It's been a long time since I talked about Miraculous, so let's get three things that needs to be talked about. Number one, where in the world is Miraculous? <laughs> so I already made an update video a few months ago, and it turns out that Kids Click got destroyed. It's gone. It didn't get to have the actual, you know, support and everything it needs, and it's just gone. So Disney swooped up and got Miraculous. Okay. And then for a few months, they had Miraculous on weird, crazy times. Like times where kids can't watch it. And then they put it on 10 a.m. And they put it in 5.30 a.m. in the morning. And it just gets pretty stupid. And now it's nowhere to be found. And I'm like, huh? So you have the first two seasons. And the third one is ongoing. And here you guys go with not even... There's nothing really to say besides Disney come to freak on. I mean, it gets to the point of where it's like, oh, well, Nickelodeon, at least Nickelodeon actually had it on, even though you had it every day. So it's like it's kind of like a big battle of, OK, um, Nickelodeon didn't allow it to disappear until they're complete idiots. But at least they had it on Saturdays. You actually had it every single day, but put it at weird times. So it's like. I don't know who was worse or who was even better at this point. Or it's like you should have just had it at maybe three o'clock, maybe four p.m. Most likely you can see it on demand. That's kind of a somewhat yay, but not really. I mean, maybe you can see it on their app, which that's good, but kind of would sort of want you to actually have it on the freaking damn TV. Just saying. So here is the funny part about episode 13 in season three. So episode, so everything was going good until the last part of where you had, um, well, let's just say his new nickname is now Miss Your Rat because the episode before he, they showed at the very end that he actually befriended a rat and he's like, oh, I wore you little creature. And it's like, oh, Miss Your Rat is beginning. And then in the next episode, it's like, oh, he forgot about the rats. Here's the pigeons. And it's like, hmm, did they forget or did there was there a glitch that happened to him or was he going to go to both or is going to happen like out of nowhere or he has dual identities where he can be two things at once, which Lila technically she did two things at once, too. So it's like, I guess there isn't a rule between that, but. He's known as Monsieur Rat later on then, you know, because it doesn't make sense that you're going to call him Monsieur Pigeon or I forgot what his name was. But still, it's like it doesn't make sense if he's not going to be all about rats. You can't just call him his old name anymore. I don't know, man. <laughs> it's like, I don't freaking know. Or maybe it was just a nudge being like, oh, there he is, even though I'm like, mm, I'm not sure. And then, of course, we get to have like some even. Hmm. OK, let me finish this. So we actually get to have some more interesting insight and some more interesting stuff in episode 14. So it turns out that Adrian's dad actually harvests the butterflies or moths either way. So he actually has this place and we saw it before. We saw it in the third season excuse me, beginning of third season. So he actually, there he actually has a bunch of, so he's basically just farming. That's what he's doing. He's basically farming moths so he can use them for his evil reasons. Well, you know, the main goal. And the main goal is this is apparently he wants to get the miraculous is no, no, don't know how many he needs, but apparently getting ladybugs, getting cat noirs and then having his, it will warp reality. And apparently they did something messed up in the past. And if they can fix that part, he'll have his wife back. And I'm still kind of nudging to the other video I made that. Pretty sure his wife actually used the Miraculous, the Peacock Miraculous. It got damaged, and since it got damaged, she got injured, and that's how she ended up there. Which, apparently, like, one or two or three people thumbs down saying, No, it's not. Yeah, um, give me your excuse then, hmm? 
I mean, given your reasoning, hmm? but hmm. he's got a warp reality. But then after that, like I asked in that other video is then what is he going to do after that? Apparently that is his only goal. Again, he is just a Maximilian Pegasus and that's it. He just wants to do this one thing. And then the miraculous can go back to him. It's like, yeah, it's kind of like, hmm. But considering kind of like the snap, at first we thought, yeah, and I wasn't really that fooled, but still, it's like we thought that the snap actually caused some messed up crap that happened in the universe. Like, oh no, now the elementals have been released in the world because of the snap, because things aren't the same. Yeah. <laughs> So could this be the same exact thing, but actually real, where it's like if he undoes it, it could actually make something worse, where it's like, well, then you're going to have to keep on putting Band-Aids until everything is back where it should be, except for your wife being alive. And then it's like it's a never ending part of where it's like you're just going to have to let her go, man. It's like we understand, but you're going to have to let her go. And apparently he's going to have to let her go anyways, considering there's going to be a new Hawk Moth in the future so eventually his mission either succeeds or fails and as soon as it does we got a brand new hawk moth and of course we have a few suspects of who it's going to be anyways yeah good show can't wait i gotta finish because i've seen i'm starting episode 14 now I gotta check out episode 15 and it sucks that i can't actually watch it on tv instead i have to watch it the usual way it's like, damn, Disney, you just showed the first two seasons. Where's the third one?